It also means bio kills. As many as we can. Uh, drop shields. Put them back. Put them down. Put them back. Do that. Flash shields. It's also evasion training. Should we try to get a um, surrender first? Yes. I run for forty-five. Yes. Yeah, that's why you want to trigger the surrenders. Sometimes rewarded. What if by a killing dog gives me a weapon? I mean... Like, this is 52 scrap. 2 drum parts, 5 fuel. And the hacking stun can even make bio kills more likely, honestly. We can take advantage of the thing for a bit. Yeah, that was a nice surrender. We need 35 for weapons buffer. I mean 25. I could have mind control first. Now, nah, whatever, let's do it this way. Keep it Zoltan. I think he will always power up with this thing. Okay, I know what to do. So we avoid that issue. Be fine. Okay, if I mind control now, oh, what well, does it work? He goes down. Yeah, it's not ideal then. Hmm. And that's level one. That's actually bad. Yeah, the hack sucks. The hacking stun actually sucks here. I fired. But we can go away before um, we take the damage.
Okay, this is mostly fine. Gotta drop shields in case it was going for two. I mean for one. Uh, dealing more damage to this guy is fine, since he has more health at the NG. Uh, not, not more health, it takes less damage with the mind control. That's two hits for this guy. One more and he's dead. We try to get another surrender first. This game is so easy. Plus it worked to our shields. Best possible weapon. For the moment, yes. The best we'll get, uh, like double flak, double heavy, it's probably the best to set up. Especially if you play without clocking. Shields. There's some oxygen back here. Since I'm probably removing power from oxygen during fights. We don't need repairs, we can only sell this too. Not worth it. Nice, we didn't even lose the beacon. Uh, how do we bio kill this one though? Med bay and bomb are pretty annoying. I think the play is to let them run out of bombs. Then we can go for the bio kill. And we want to vent here in case of uh, fires. I can't, uh, I mean, maybe I can even with that one. I can't, I shouldn't keep the guy there, otherwise, I can try to dodge the bombs on my slugs. It will be hard though. Actually, yeah, don't repair the weapon. No, why am I venting there? We don't want to repair this because if his small bomb plus fires, the system goes down and we take damage. If, if it's already damaged, we, yeah, I should not repair this.
Ah, I couldn't. It's so hard. Oh, there are the bombs. Then we can begin. I think I can do this without using hacking. Can I? The med bay is not ideal. Bridge is very good. finish he cannot the surrender sucks and this is way better Easy. I'm not delaying for training, but if this was a normal run, I will stay here until I'm fully trained after that breach. I will fully train weapons and uh, evasion. Well, sure. And I mean, chain lasers, if you're stuck in them, they're not even too bad. Yes. Like, okay, normally I will, uh, I probably will not do that trade because um, with this challenge we cannot buy weapons. So if I don't find weapons but I end up with missiles, technically you want a decent missile uh, amount. But now that we have uh, these three weapons already, I, I doubt I will play missiles at all this run. I should probably get a power bar. Uh, this fight is not safe. But I think it's okay. Are you fucking serious? Double miss? Come on.
Easy. Not even close. Do we have more? Can't hear anything. I have uh, so many drone parts, so let's avoid the damage. Maybe I can get the first level. Maybe not. I'm okay with the uh, remember because if I bring him home, I could roll repairs and I, it will be just the one repair. Rather get the guy. Oh, we can get an NG here as well. Sure. You could gamble and uh, try to get the resources with the NG, but I don't know. Guaranteed NG, it's better. Civilian or abandoned? I mean, civilian. But sectors are good, but civilian is better. Um, more likely to get bio kill in the civilian sectors. And uh, it's mostly because if you get bio kills in the abandoned sector, you get a drone instead of a weapon as a free reward. I have 40 fuel. Hmm. So store will be just to sell those two. Not worth it. We're wasting a beacon for no reason. If there's more stores, it's just plus one, maybe. We're going through the nebula. Let's get the power. This just beacon is fine, we have Columbia Angie. Uh this is better. Guaranteed reward. I don't care about additional crew at the moment. This is a free win. I'll probably use the... yeah, let's use the heavy. So I can put power in oxygen. Keeping the weapons up for some training. Potential training. With the Ion Blast, there we go. This should be very easy. I should have waited for my char chain laser to be charged. So I could just to kill here. But maybe I want to try to trigger a surrender first. Whatever. 
another NG. Huh. Sure. Can't buy weapons or crew. Do I care? I mean, the main thing is not, not buying a clocking. That could suck. Letting him board is better, actually. It will take way more damage than... Uh, like, Rock NG is the worst combo for my control. Because the NG deals no damage to the Rock and the Rock has more health. Wait for the NG to board. Kill this NG. So it's two hits. The heavy arrived in between the laser, the heavy, whatever, the laser shots. I was supposed to deal one more damage first to trigger a potential surrender. It's okay though. So we already got the auto ship, so this is either piloting or borders. Well, it doesn't matter. Can go there with no shields. Unlucky. Easy fight. I don't want the quest. The quest, I'm pretty sure it's the Mantis War Camp. I don't have a missile to trigger the, the fight. So it could just be an empty beacon. Hey, Roluk. Um, I'm getting weapons up. Running away. Annoying. Can we bio kill this one? I think I made a mistake. Yeah, I can't. 
Like two guys took too much damage and then I didn't have anyone for the third guy. They don't have enough all. If they were not running away... I don't know, maybe I could have had a... Uh, could go for a... Could have taken an oxygen hacker there. Yes, I actually did it. Get fucked. I took the risk. Now it fires two shots. Easy game. If you're a very good player, you can, um... A any laser weapon that fires multiple shots, you can hack in a way that uh, it fires only a portion of the shots. And then when it fires again, it fires the remaining ones. So the first time it fires one shot, and then the second time the other two. But it's a very, 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 very unreliable thing. I think it's a frame perfect hacking, so you kind of have to get lucky to get it. It was worth the risk because, uh, like in this case, it's worth the risk because if I just hack normally, what do I gain? Nothing. Mm, like normally, you want to hack weapons so that you're firing your weapons before they do. But since they hacked my weapons as well, they were firing that burst laser too before me anyway. So might as well take the risk. And he paid off. To be fair, it was a minor thing. Because, I mean, if they fire two shots, even if they fire three shots and they hit everything, and they go into weapons, I'll still have the heavy online. I mean, I'll lose, just lose the heavy and have the chain lasers online, but I don't know. I think it was fine. There we go. I might let this guy repair once. I want to mind control this guy since it's full health. I think repairing once it's okay. And I didn't, because I forgot. You know what, it's okay. One died. Now we'll wait for the repairs though. To remove that. That's faster. A rock. Hmm. I don't want crew. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe it's a pre-igniter here. With a rock. Storage cache. We are getting so many good events. I mean, a civilian sector. With a big nebula. Look like a sector for a ship. I mean, it's like see you started with docking and mind control. We just added two weapons on top of what you have normally. 
So it's, yeah, it's kind of normal for the ship. Stun bomb. Not the ideal weapon, but it's a weapon. We keep it unless we get something else. Here the follow watch this. Uh, what about this? It's not a, a great crew for the mind control bio kill. What about this? This, this town bomb. What about that? Hmm. You gotta follow as well, last click. But it's okay. Wait. How much do we need for the rock? Yeah, we should be fine. I don't mind trading some hole for uh, a bio kill. Have more. No weapons. It's okay. Am I selling uh, the stuff? I don't know if Akin's stun is good or not. Like, Akin's stun is good with the uh, fires. But it's bad with the uh, mind control. Because, let's be honest, most of the time... We are mind controlling and let them, letting them fight in the actor room. And sometimes there will be s weapons still online that I have to hack, and so I'm stunning them during the hack, and they're not they're not getting uh, value out of the mind control. Like it's only good if you have fires. And I mean, I don't know. I don't think it's good. It's just a thirty scrap. It's like repair gel. I mean, I have seven crew members, no point keeping it. I don't even think you have any blue option with the slug repair gel. You can only buy repairs. Let's do it. We get back in level two. Power. Power engines, and that's it for now. Five damage, no good. Uh, we risk this. There's the word, the bad outcome is uh, borders plus ASB, but I have seven crew members, my control, where we're fine. And the good outcome is two borders plus a fight. I guess that's fine as well. Abandoned or Angie? We go abandoned and we try to find the event uh, for the weapon craft. How much is that? 50? 55? I don't remember. I think it's 50. It will be an um, advanced edition weapon. It can be another chain laser. It can be Flak. Flak 2. Stunner. What else is decent? I don't know.
Other possible weapon plays that work and the UTFT ally managed to win with Flak, Hubbard's laser to some kind of beam. Um, I mean, anything works. The FTL is not really about builds. You put together whatever you find, and then it, it's fine. But the, there are some weapons that are just better than others, so if you find them, usually you just want to play those weapons. I have um, a weapon tier list, if you want. So you can check that out for, uh, I don't know, an indication of what are the good weapons. Where is it? This thing. I know that the, the tier list is not counting uh, starting weapons that you have only with specific ships. So it's not counting stuff like uh, mini beams, uh, basic lasers and such. Only the stuff that you can buy. We have Plum Bay Rock Engine, so I'm going for the Distress Beacon, even if it can be an empty one. What is this? Reigniter. Reloader will also be great. Drone Recovery. Well, sure. It's a good augmentation, but not for us. But yeah, the best weapons in the game are Flak, Burst Laser 2, Heavy Laser, Halber Beam. They're just the strongest weapons. But you can play with pretty much anything. But as a new player, we'll recommend avoiding stuff like missiles. They're good than the enemies, and that's it. Okay, fight is over. Um, multiple beam setup it's very good if you play... if you have hacking and clocking. But to be consistent, uh, you like it requires using the hacking trick to avoid the defense drones. Iron and bombs. Yeah, iron and bombs together is not a great combination. It's only good if you're playing a teleporter as well. But it will be mostly for the bombs and then the irons to remove Zoltan shields so that you can board. Without the teleporter, you just don't have damage. Because bombs don't deal damage, ions don't deal damage, you need damage. And if you're playing a teleporter though, you don't need the damage because you want to kill the crew. So you can use the bombs as a support to remove systems and ions as a support to remove Zoltan shields. Five damage. Unlucky. Stop. What do you think of Charge Laser 2? It's not a good weapon. Like, it's a weapon that you play when you don't have other better... when you don't have better weapons. It's a below average weapon. It's... it's slow and expensive. 15 seconds, 3 power for 3 shots. It's... it could be nice because it's versatile, sometimes you can fire. But it's... A weapon that you can play sometimes in the early mid game when you don't have uh, other weapons, but overall it's not a good weapon. Same with the whole laser too. We don't need this thing. Just repairs. Uh, quest is good. A random Lanius. 
Ok. Last chance for the crafting event. And with the Lanyas it will be even better since it's less expensive. Unlucky. We can give the missiles. Repair armor. Sure. Uh, Slugger Pirate. I mean, we can go Slug and uh, gamble for the free weapon. I mean, free. It's not free. For the, the weapon event. Is it 50-50 to succeed? Ah. Sure, whatever. It's just begin, then we go into the nebula. Uh, I should upgrade probably. Let's play the stun bomb. Okay. One percent to get scammed. Nah, we'll find something good. Uh, you know what? I shouldn't be greedy. Level 2, as expected, they could even be level 3. Okay, just level 2. I think that's enough. I can't even attempt a surrender. Actually, it's slugs. Never mind. Surrender offers with slugs. Ah, uh, not ideal. Wait for the other guy. I don't want to risk a fire. So I'm just waiting. Because what if they have uh, engines 1? I mean engines 3. I deal 2 damage plus the fire and then they explode. That will be bad. We don't need stores for now. This is the only connection. Oh god. Well, let me, yeah, we take that later. You know what? Let's play around the glaive beams. It's not like I can buy weapons anyway. They have a nice weapon setup. No, that's fine. But yeah, I don't think the bio kills are happening here.
She's also good against lasers. Sure. But I mean, against ships like this, technically I could dock weapons and be fine. But if I have a glaive, not necessarily. No mind control bio kills, yeah. I'll try to go for fire and buy kills here though. They're dead. The stun bomb was probably even unnecessary. Then the fire will spread in oxygen and they're dead. They can't uh, deal with oxygen. And once they try to... Actually, no, I have to keep the arcing, otherwise it doesn't spread. They've upgraded doors. Okay, now... Ah, let them... Uh... Poor slugs. Immune to mind control, but not immune to fires. Nice shave. What is this? This garbage. Unfortunately, they have. Uh, oh, whatever. It's gonna be fine anyway. What is this ship, though? I could have killed them right now. Let's wait for the next mind control. What's my training? Hmm. Still quite a bit. Empty room level 3. Yes. Hmm, that firebomb being still online, it's annoying. Please. No surrender. It has dungeons today. Yes. After this FTL run. Burn. Uh, even if the fire spread into piloting, uh, where the bio kill is secured, kind of. Yeah, I've been enjoying Desi Dungeons quite a bit as well. Today, we, we have to finish with the, the Jester. When the Jester is the only one left for the episode 6. Then there is the bonus thing, which I don't know what it is. And then we can even try probably episode 6 in hard mode. I don't know what exactly changes. If enemies are just stronger or what. Bonus episodes after the Jester, yeah. I'm keeping the repair arm, right? Why not? Oh, 
Okay, it's the slug shift that gives you the weapon. In the nebula or outside the nebula? All enemy equipment is upgraded. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that the the upgraded equipment it's pretty bad on certain enemies and I mean obviously it's bad in general, but it's specifically bad against some of them. Uh, look at that. Uh, um, no, nah, there, there is no point. I think I'd rather play the stun bomb than the ion blast. Feels bad. Rebel or Zoltan? We go Rebel. Or maybe they can try to roll piloting events. Maybe we find more weapons. Yeah, that's fine. Actually, I didn't want the the laser shot. Oh, they have the system, I mean the anti-personnel as well. Let's wait. Find though. Forty one. Four. Why so many fires in there? Ah oh, shit. Too late. Mm. 
Mm, I don't know. Let's just go for the kill. Who cares? Hey, Orox. I don't think I can get this one. I wonder why this doesn't work. Like, um, how come my control doesn't work when they are out of ships? I don't know why. If they have the actual mind control system, it's fine. It's just specifically uh, the hacking. Outer ships, yes. Like even the flagship, um, if they hack your mind control, it works as long as they have, you have crew. Once you bio kill their crew, then their hacking uh, stops working. It's weird. Did you get into the situation? Yes, two days ago. This is bad. This is fine. We tank some damage, but it's okay. Of course, the only weapon that stays online is the one that can deal damage. And my evasion has been very bad. It's fine, we'll get a pre-igniter here. Or not. Or maybe. I don't know why I tried to be greedy though. Oh, that's why. Me. I, I, I don't know why I'm not hacking. Jesus Christ. Why not? I have so many drone parts. It's just because it's so likely to just... Like, not needing it. My god. Okay, but fuck you. This is going down as well, otherwise it will be there. Mm. 
Um, I don't know if I have seven like that. I'll try. Okay, fight is over. Anything good? It's four plus a nebula beacon, so it's fine. Um, I don't know. Let's get this. Let's get this into power bars. Pulsar. Nah, it's fine. They have two shields as well. Nope. Yeah, that's better. I don't think even maybe. Only flag two online. Okay, they're dead. It's warm. Mm, not ideal, but I could use it instead of the stun bomb later. Take the cargo for myself. Uh, nothing. Unlucky. They don't know what to do. Uncharted. Uh, still piloting event for potential free stuff. Hard to find with those scanners though. Unlucky. Mm -hmm. 
We are relatively safe this fight. So we want to... Um... Wait for the other guy to board. Actually, you know what? This is better. Wait for the NG to go there. Annoying. Intruder sucks. Okay, it's in a good spot. Then it's fine. I assume the missile will still be online. Running. Could have opened for the other guy first. Are you really running? Oh my god, you... Ah, oh, fuck, I thought this guy will die. Whatever. I mean, uh... I, I thought that he will die with the heavy. It's fine. I mean, I have 40 fuel sector 2. Give them here. I think I'd rather stay in the nebula as long as possible. I shall probably just go for shields. Like, why not? What am I buying? Uh, keeping my stuff. I don't even know though if the swarm is better than the stun bomb, honestly. And that says a lot about the swarm. A dive. 
Yeah, be at the store. We have too many guys. Let's go, pirate. You know what? Yes. That's fight without clocking, it's so bad. And it can be even worse if they hack my weapons. Okay, the drone stopped. Still going. Stopped. Fuck. I mean, I cannot kill it. One hole off. Mm. I tried. Because the thing is, yeah, I, the only way to first bio kills will be through oxygen hack. But those fights are just bad for me to go with oxygen hack. Like my weapons, I, I had these weapons from sector 1 and they were very good back then, but then I got nothing. Uh, nothing else for all these sectors. It's good scrap, but yeah, scrap doesn't matter if you can't use it. Maybe we remove that one. Nope. And it goes into weapons. Perfect. Isn't this great? Yep, that's fucking amazing. Put the bomb up there and stop the thing. I really don't want to skip this fight though. This is so stupid. Like if I had faster weapons, I could uh, hack a piloting most of most of the times for shields. But since my weapons are slow, I don't know. Hmm. 
Scanners. The one pulsar fights. Actually, I don't think I care about doors. We shall then the fight before I have to deal with this guy. Are you already in scrap war? I mean, what am I doing with it? Sure, I can get. 3% more evasion. I don't know. There we go. Can I deal zero damage with my fucking volley, please? I, I mean, I forgot to mind control, but... <sighs> Even with the mind control, it's still shit. I don't care about losing shields, I just want to reduce the odds of losing weapons. Why the mantis out of every fucking one? Oh my god, please, you fucking piece of shit. Literally the only one. He bugged. This guy's not moving. Nice, he moved the, the, from the Diggot fires. But we didn't get anything anyway. We have to wait for the shields now. We have billions of ions in there. It will take a bit.
Got to wait for the good timing. Okay, next one we go. You know they follow a noble couple. Missile still online. No fires. Black ship is gonna be bad with my weapons. I can't even my control. Is my engine in danger? Nah, it's fine. Hmm, I don't know. At this point, I don't think we're getting... Uh, Better stuff. Door. Three weapons, sector eight are very, very unlikely. I think they're more likely in between flagship phases than in anywhere else. But what if? Maybe we can trap them. Nah. I mean, they will just repair it. Yeah, I, they, I cannot get this bio kill.
It's just very hard to get bike kills at this point with these weapons. This is so bad on so many levels. I just let walk weapons and go away. This fight is just an absolute shit. Four shields, double missile with a uh, arcing uh, level two on weapons. I see. Unless their evasion sucks completely. Which it does, but it's still bad. I mean, I might take the fight at the end though. I have a repair arm. Yeah, but it's so unlikely to deal damage. So we repair up to 29. Weapons act is so bad, please stop. One more try. Like the spider might not even be worth the missiles, honestly. Me, yeah, I don't know why I'm fighting. Maybe they bring off the chain laser. Okay. This might be coming back soon. I'm very tempted by stun bomb phase one. But it's probably not good. Let's go. Let's not take other fights, I don't want to take more damage. Annoying, but fine. It'll be okay. Where's the runaway? Can I kill this one at least? Okay, one more. I might take damage though for that. timings 
Okay, I'm probably taking an F fight. Just to try to get some repairs. Please don't be bullshit. Outpost is double repair so we can get the four. They have a missile though, so maybe maybe we take more damage than what we repair. I have to act shields, they have billions of shields. Missed everything. Yeah, we're not repairing shit. I mean, I don't know, my, my vision though is complete garbage. Like, I have engines, engines 69 and I'm taking everything. Is it the only one? I get a plus two after phase uh, two. If I survive phase two, seven, we kill two. I have to go for shields. We got a few kills. And this one as well. Hmm. I mean, I can get anything with 30. No, just tank. I should have cloned those two though. No point in not cloning. The others are fine. So I will have 55% evasion. Will it work? Let's find out. So lucky that we might control that guy back. Piloting, obviously. later with 55% um, we're fine now though
Okay. Yeah, flagship is never uh, easy without clocking. We found chain laser FV sector one, and then just a stun bomb and a swarm missile for six sectors. I mean, and th that potential ion blast for forty five, but ion blast was better than my weapons. Like either uh, swarm and stun bomb are better than ion blast. But yeah, I think that this is legacy challenge is in a good spot. Because it forces you to bio kill, then you have to play with random weapons and uh, flagship, especially without clocking. Like because if you have clocking, even if you're playing these weapons, then the flagship it's perfectly fine. <laughs> 